And we're back with Ace Attorney Investigations, Part 70. Also, Gadopian National Anthem. Now, we were talking to Polina, right? Mmm, yeah, I'm sure I would. Huh. Not hardly. Well, anyway. Let's go for a run. There was something I was missing, and it was and it was in the desk. You see that drawer? It's quite obviously open. Yes, we can rifle through the drawer. can't take the pen. We can deduce, though. Now, you see that funny-looking, uh... pad thingy? We have something that looks rather similar to it. We found it in Mask to Mask 2's hand. <clears throat> One moment. That's what we needed. Indeed it did. In our country? <laughs> Purpose of studying them, to create our own souvenirs. We will make them bigger, stronger, faster. Dun 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 no thanks. I thought your office burned anyway. Manny's handwriting. Manny Cochin's handwriting. Ooh. Oh my. So, not only was Manny involved in smuggling, now he hired a, a lousy thief to steal the primitive statue from Alabast. Oh? What might that be? I'd really like to know, mister. Your fault. Hmm. Okay. That got cancelled. Fair enough. Really? Oh, it... Yeah, we've heard that before. The ball statue is the fake. Ah. And especially once they reunite and become Kadopi again. Let me handle it, it'll be alright. And you just let that go. Oh my. It seems so. I agree, Edgeworth. No one d gets involved in that much criminal activity just for the good of a... Just to be a pal to his buddy. Gumshoe! Dick! How you doing, Val?
Wait, what? The roof. Before and after the... Wait a kick. You know what that means. Haha, <laughs> yes you are, Gumshoe. Really? Oh. Alright, you do that, Kay. Wait. Indeed it is. To give Little Thief a workout. Mr. Thief? Yes. Little Thief. Skies of evening when no other bird dares take wing. One alone remains all seeing. The Yadagarasu. You know, one thing I like that they did to Little Thief in Ace Attorney Investigations 2, they actually made, like, some of the images flicker and stuff, like it's an actual digital pro projection. It's really quite cool. First off, the obvious problem, the grandfather clock has moved. Hmm. But why? Something's up with the clock. Do it, Gumshoe. A length of wire? <laughs> Interesting. It's a valuable clock. Or Mr. Cochin himself, maybe? Ah, so something burning. Something with Bobbly's ink burning. Died out or something. <laughs> Until the head of Karasu. Oh, or the fake appeared. We'll be operating under that assumption from now on. Next object is finding out who it was. Hmm, I think I know. Yes, we have. Bobbly's ink burns green. Fire-related piece of evidence. That's gotta be the lantern he's asking for. Yep. It's just an example of what can fucking happen when you play the game before. You're thinking two or three moves ahead. I think 
Polana was mistaken about. The next step in the thought process? The Bobbleys Inc. Take that. <laughs> Didn't work. Bugger. Didn't shout loud enough. Oh well. Indeed. So now it's time for the final step in this thought process. Indeed. Simple answer. Oh yes, the gears are turning. This is the source of the green flames. That would be counterfeit bills. Take that! Bugger. I am the disappoint now. chance of that. <coughs> or rather, borrow it. For uncouth purposes. <coughs> hmm. Indeed you have. What are you re what are you really hiding, Polena? Alright, next up. Hmm. Fair enough. This is interesting. <laughs> sure, sounds good. out the window. Oh, we've had this conversation already. Eh. Let's examine the statue. Eh, let's not examine the statue. Let's end the video. Until then. Until then. <laughs>